during a recent podcast hosted by Shaquille O'Neal himself, he mentioned you as one of the toughest white centers he played against. Uh, you know, that's a really, really great accomplishment, especially coming from uh, the, Shaq himself, knowing that he's not the kind of guy to applaud his opponents uh, very often. What were those matchups with him like? You know, I was, uh, <clears throat> uh, yeah, I was always a smart player. Uh, and uh, when you play Shaquille O'Neal, you cannot go and fight with him because you're losing that. And um, you have to use your speed, but you cannot use your speed if you cannot shoot from outside. And I could do both of those things. So I gave him a lot of problems because... Uh, when he let me shoot, I shoot and I made him. And then when he comes close, I, I go by him and he couldn't, uh, he, he, he couldn't stop me. So that uh, my third year, we had like five games against them and I averaged like 27 against uh, Orlando. Wow. And uh, definitely he remembers that. <laughs> uh, and, and you know, guarding him, it's never one one job. It's always... Uh, doubling, two, tripling. Three against one because otherwise uh, he's going to eat you for breakfast. <laughs> uh, actually, uh, the, the, the post-Jordan era uh, saw the rest of the teams of all around the great uh, MVP caliber centers like uh, Shaq, uh, Hakim Olajuwon, Patrick Ewing, David Robinson. Which one of uh, those centers was, was your toughest matchup? Maybe Shaq or somebody else? You know, there are different guys. Um, Shaquille was unbelievably strong. And, uh, and and movable. He, but he was not dangerous outside of the paint. And uh, Olajuwon, he was you know full package with his uh, fakes and quickness. And he was not that tall, but he was so quick and he knew basketball so well that uh, he was unpredictable and very very hard to guard. Um, then you had uh, David Robinson, who was a little late and. Um, uh, Ewing also much lighter than these than, than Shaquille O'Neal, but they had their own, you know, qualities, uh, all-star qualities. But you know, different players. Uh, you have to watch them, see what they're doing, and then you try to stop uh, their best moves. And you cannot stop all of them, but uh, you, you you get help, and you try to stop. What you see is their, you know, uh, trademark move, and then you make yourself uh, make your life easier during the game. But uh, th those guys, you can, you know, you can not stop one one on one. 